Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. So if you watched my last video, I did say that this week I'm posting a review video on Forever Mood. If you don't know what Forever Mood is, it is Jackie Ina's luxury brand. Okay, you know, I just, I had to. I love me some Jackie. I like, I love me some Jackie. Okay, like, boom. I have her artist couture highlight over here. Her palette, I also have her palette right here with Anastasia Beverly Hills. I actually keep it over by like my fake flowers over there because I like it as decoration and I'm scared that if I use this up, I can't buy it again. Um, but I probably can. I'm just scared. And also, girl, she's just beautiful. Not only in the box, but when she's out of the box, she's beautiful. Um, I just need to use it more. I bought all four of the candles and I bought one of these silk headbands. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and pull out the headband this is oh this is like a nice little box I'm gonna keep this box I don't know where what I'm gonna put in the box but I'm gonna keep it okay so she's here she's open take it out <laughs> so this silk headband is made out of 100% mulberry silk mulberry 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 millsberry so here it is okay I got it in the shade pink there's actually two champagne and pink but I got pink cuz I love pink if you know me I love me some pink but if you literally saw me today and how I dress you would have sworn my favorite color was blue blue jeans blue shirt with a blue bag you would have sworn my favorite color is blue also if you go on like my main Instagram page you would think my favorite color is blue nope I do not like the color blue anyways I'm putting her on now I don't even care Wow, I love the Christmas flakes. Yo, like the hair products that I use mix so badly in my hair. It looks like I have dandruff. I'm going to co-wash my hair either tonight or tomorrow because I can't. So I'm gonna just wear this forever, okay? All right, so that's the headband. I've just been staring at myself this whole time. Um, So let's go on with the scents. All right, so I'm gonna start off with the candles I actually did smell before. Um. So then, because I already have, kind of have like my thoughts and try to figure out the sense to me. And then with the other two, y'all gonna get my genuine, like, first time, never been seen before reaction. Well, actually, all these reactions have never been seen before by anyone because I don't like people knowing who I am. That doesn't, that sounds bad. <laughs> Okay, so I will say right now on the website, the only things that are in stock are the headbands. Literally, the gift set of the candles are out of stock, all the individual candles are out of stock, and the silk pillowcases are out of stock, which I did not buy those. Um, I'm going to buy them, but they're like $50 per pillowcase. I'm like, did I really want to spend like $200 on pillowcases right now? No, not really. But let me pull up these scent profiles. Okay, so for scent details on left on red, it says the top note is tropical fruit, the heart is coconut and coconut milk, and the base is caramel. Um, if you know me, I do not like um, coconut at all. Like, keep that scent, keep the taste, keep the texture, keep it away from me. So I was scared when I bought this one. But, <laughs> girl. Oh my goodness, this, this to me smells like, I don't even remember what the brand is, but it smells like a certain brand of bubble gum. Mm. It smells, oh, it smells so good. It's like, I literally, I, 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 I want to eat it. That's, that's why I'm thinking it's bubble gum. Cause like my initial reaction is to, I don't really smell like tropical fruit to me maybe a hint of caramel I personally don't really me personally I don't really smell too much of coconut or coconut milk in here so thank god because I do not like that also I believe all these candles are actually coconut based like they're um suspects Let's see. yeah it's made out of 100% natural coconut soy wax so boom also they have a burn time up to 65 hours and they're 10 ounces all right next one is cuffing season now this one baby <laughs> oh okay so the top note for cuffing season it says is fresh ozone 
like a fresh ozone layer because we need a new one i know ours is now closed up or closing up or something but we still need a new one because of what's happening you know um also salty lemon and mineral citrus the heart is iris violet and jasmine and the base is douglas fir rainforest moss and white cedar now i don't really know what all those smell like to be honest but oh my god oh if i had a man i want him to smell like this all the time if I had a man and if he smelled like this, I would be pregnant right now. Right now. It, uh, uh, uh. Jackie, if you want to make like, you know, body mist, perfumes, whatever you want to do, you know, can you turn this one into like a perfume, please? Because like, I even want to smell like this, but... Girl, girl, cupping season. Oh, yes. This video is kind of all over the place. Um, I'm very tired. Um, I had a very long day, guys. Okay. Uh, so these candles are actually $35 each. Okay. And if you buy the gift set, it's $120. So that means you would save like $15 if you buy like the gift set. So if you want to get it for someone, or if you want to get it for yourself, I say, girl, get it for yourself, girl. Gift yourself. Get yourself the smell of luxury. <laughs> luxury, sorry. Okay, so for matcha business, this is cute matcha business. Um, the top note is hazelnut coffee, almond milk, and honey. I love the smell of like almonds. I, it smells so good. Um, the heart is coffee and lavender and the base is vanilla. Now I have not smelled this one or the, uh, the, the other one. So let's do this. Ooh. 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 This one's pretty strong. I kind of feel this one going in my eyeballs. That's actually very, wow. You could smell like the coffee. It has like, it has like, like a little hint of like coffee and cocoa, even though cocoa is not in here, but that's what I'm smelling. You know what? It's probably the hazelnut. That's probably what it was. Hazelnut coffee. Mmm. Oh, the, oh. This is a morning candle, not just because it smells like coffee, but it just really does energize me. But at the same time, it has lavender in it. So maybe it's like that, that like calming high, not like a high, whatever. But you know, that calming rise to, you know, like, okay, let's go, let's get up, let's start the day. Mmm. This definitely smells like a nice warm drink. Oh, okay. I'm getting that hint of lavender. I should have been taking these out. Uh, the thing, I just realized I've just been holding it like this. This is also like a good candle to burn after you done cleaned up your house. You know how like your house smells like cleaning products? Probably smells like some fresh linens because you probably got, you know, the Febreze fresh linen all up in there. This one is a nice candle to burn literally after you done deep cleaned your house, which I should do that to this room. That's a really good candle. Wow. Wow, I really thought I wasn't gonna like this one. I am happy that I'm wrong. The last one is Caked Up. This is the one that I got with the other three, but I didn't smell it because I feel like this is gonna be my favorite one. Also, it's pink. Um, so yes, so the scent details for Caked Up, the top notes are Roasted Pistachio, Pistachio, really? Pistachio, there we go, um, Almond Cream and Pineapple, the heart is Honey, Jasmine, and Coconut, and the base is Vanilla Bean and Musk. Ooh, I actually like Musk. So let's do this, girlies.
The fact that you could just smell this before you open, like the actual. Mm. This one smells like, to be honest, it smells like a little bit of left on red mixed with a little bit of matcha business and like an expensive bakery. So all three of those, to me, it smells like matcha business, left on red, and an expensive bakery. I'm getting icing for sure. Not like cheap icing. Like this is like, oh, this is some icing. You probably spent some money on it. I'm not really getting pineapple in here. Surprisingly enough, this is not my favorite one. It's the prettiest one in my opinion, but it's not my favorite. Ah, am I still gonna burn it? Yes, this is definitely making me hungry. I'm not gonna lie. All right, so those were all the candles. Those are the scents as best as I could describe it. Everyone's nose is different. So just because it says what it smells like online, it could smell different to you. Like they smell different to me in a way. Um, but I kind of want to rank them. Um, I'm gonna do from least favorite to most favorite. Shockingly enough for me, Caked Up is my least favorite. I'm not saying it smells bad, it smells good, but it's like, I mean, it wouldn't be the first one that I would grab to purchase again. But it's very pretty. I probably would just literally buy it just because it's pink. Um, I don't mind, I don't mind. Let's see, my next favorite, well, the next one up would be, to be honest, it would be left on red. Hold on, let me smell it one more time. Yeah, it would be left on red, even though it definitely does smell very good. It smells like bubble gum. I just feel like it smells very sweet to me personally. And I like sweet smells, but I don't know. Sometimes it makes my stomach feel weird. Sometimes, I don't know, my body stomach is very weird. All right. Hmm. Next in second place would be Matcha Business because it definitely does smell very energizing it does have that coffee scent it actually smells kind of herbal as well like a little bit of like a little bit of a freshness to it and i would definitely love to burn that when i just clean my room or i pretend like i did clean my room so i just want to lie to myself and then my absolute favorite is cuffing season not only because it smells like a man it smells like my future husband okay it it may i i want a like a lotion i want a perfume i just want this on my body please i need also this is the most appropriate not only name but scent for fall oh i should order these by season okay so this one is fall matcha business is definitely a spring um i feel like oh wait this was kind of hard then because hmm because both of these i feel like both of these could be summer left on bread and caked up you know what Caked up is winter and left on red is summer. Boom. I helped you with your seasons. So for fall, okay, we're in fall or we're about to get into fall right now. Cuffing season, okay? And then winter, caked up. All right? Then spring, matcha business, okay? And then for summer, left on red. You can order those however way you want, but that's what they smell like to me. All right, so I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope it was helpful. I hope Jackie Ina sees this. If she does, I will literally pass away and I would be okay with that. I love you, Jackie. Can you adopt me, please? If you liked this video, please give it a like and also comment down below. Do you have these? Do you? Um, if you don't, girl, you're going to have to wait a while for the restock because I don't know when she restocking. <laughs> Just saying, I don't know when she's going to restock. I hope she does the pillowcases because I want to get me like at least a pillowcase. Okay, I want a pillowcase. Um, 
Were any of these scents, you know, they sound interesting to you? If you are subscribed, please click that notification bell so you get notified every time I post. And if you are not subscribed, please do because you're trying to get to 2,000 subscribers. All right, I'm gonna go. Bye. Woo, okay, this bra is coming off. I can't.